In today's video, I will be showing you how to fix the warning known issues with graphics card driver message when trying to launch Fortnite on your Windows 10 PC or laptop. As you can see, I've got the warning up on my screen at the moment, and this has just popped up when I went to launch Fortnite. And basically what it's telling me is, I don't have the latest NVIDIA graphics card driver installed. I have an old version and there are some known issues with the driver that I have installed. So I need to go ahead and download and install the latest driver. This is the same if you don't have an NVIDIA graphics card, if you have an AMD graphics card, or if you're using an Intel graphics card, then the same process applies. Basically, you need to go to the site for your graphics card and download the latest graphics card driver. So in this video, we will be taking a look at an NVIDIA graphics card driver. So I now need to go ahead and close down this window. So once you have closed down the window and also closed down Fortnite, you now need to go ahead and click on the link that's in the description below. I will also put the links to AMD and Intel as well, where you can get the drivers for your graphics card if you're using those graphics cards. So we now need to go ahead and select our graphics card. So I have a GeForce, which means I need to select GeForce. I also have a 16 series, which means I need to select GeForce 16 series. I have a 1660 Super, and I have Windows 10 64 bit, and I want to download the Game Ready driver. I now need to go ahead and press search. You need to do the same once you have selected your graphics card. If you're not sure what graphics card you do have, then you can always go ahead and open up the start menu and type in DX Diag and then press enter. You can then go ahead and press yes. If you now go ahead and click on display, you can see there it says chip type and I have a GTX 1660 Super and it also says the name at the top. This is where your graphics card name will be and that's what you need to download the drivers for. I can now go ahead and press download and then we need to press download again and then save file. So once the driver has finished downloading, you then need to go ahead and run the setup file. You now need to press OK. You will now have two options. You can choose if you want to just install the graphics card driver on its own, or you can install the driver and also GeForce Experience. I actually quite enjoy GeForce Experience, so I'm going to leave this option selected and then press agree and continue if you do agree. You now need to go ahead and press express the recommended. You can select custom if you do want to select what you want to install, but I recommend you just select express just to keep it nice and simple. We can then go ahead and press next. Once the install has finished, you can then decide if you want to create a shortcut for GeForce experience. I don't want to, and I don't want to launch it at this time. I can now go ahead and press close. As you can see, the version I installed is 471.11. So if I press close, and if I now right click on the NVIDIA icon in the system tray and then click on control panel. If you now agree to the terms, go ahead and press agree. If you do, you can now see I have the latest graphics card driver installed. So if I now go ahead and launch Fortnite, I will no longer get that warning message. And there you go. That is how you resolve that warning when trying to launch Fortnite. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, Hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.